Julian Williams, how you feeling tonight, brother? Good, now I'm ready to come here and see some boxing. When, we, when the hell are we going to see you back in the ring, soon, man? Soon, now working on something, man, real soon. What you working on, buying more apartment buildings? Uh, that too, but right now just boxing. Gotcha. Um, in terms of, you know, Booth has kind of been like the guy that, you know, Philly's been buzzing about. Yeah. Do you think that he's ready for guys like Spence and Crawford right now? Yeah, I do. What makes you say that, though, man? Why not? What makes you think you're not ready? Well, I guess people would say the level of competition he's for. Nobody's going to test him at this level yet now. He's going to keep beating these dudes up in one or two rounds. Nobody's going to imagine nothing with him. So he might as well go up and test the big dogs in the division. He ready, though. I, I'm a, I'm a, are you officially done with 154 pounds? I'm going to test my words at 60. Okay. Any names are particularly you looking to try to get out? Whoever got a world title, that's why I'm on a world title fight. We know that, but you know fans always want to hear a name, man. Like, if, is there anybody in particular that doesn't have a belt that you're just like, I want to fight this guy before I get to the title? No. K-Rock, Marcus Hayes will fight up, bro. Uh, I want to get your reaction. What's up? It's a real historic night in women's boxing tonight. Oh, uh, watch both of them. I was literally... I don't want to say this out loud, but I literally uh, drove all the way up here watching the fight on my phone, the ESPN app. Uh, Baumgarten and the mayor for a real good fight. And before the fight, I thought the Baumgarten and mayor probably was going to be better than the show the fight because I didn't think I didn't think that Holly or the, uh, the uh, other girl, uh, whatever her name is, she's a great fighter though. But she fought... Savannah Marshall. Savannah. Exactly. She fought a lot better than I expected. That girl can fight. She's big. She's strong. And she came well prepared. And... Uh, it was a close fight, but Clarissa clearly won the fight. What do you think? Uh, how do you think Clarissa showed? Uh, what do you think she showed of herself to stand up under the fight, the fire of Marshall, who, who put a steady diet she of punches on her all night? She didn't show me nothing I didn't already know she had. Uh, she's a great fighter. I mean, I just, I'm just a little bit aggravated that America won't, the networks and everything won't get behind her and push her even more. That girl's a star, man. She's, a, she's a sweetheart. I, mean, I just. I just think it's a shame. She got to go all the way to the UK to get some get some love. You know what I mean? But she's a great fighter. She wants to go wherever she go. J-Rock, let's shift gears to tonight. Uh, Red Man Edwards uh, came over coaching with Kayla Plant. Yeah. I talked to Red Man. Red Man had a real huge glowing uh, report of you. He told me uh, that he, he, you, lived, you lived with him at one point, man. That your relationship was real solid. Uh, tell me about the Red Man effect and what it could potentially do for Kayla Plant tonight. Oh, uh, gonna see. We gotta wait to see. I think uh, I think Killer Plank gonna fight his fight, but people gotta understand that they haven't been together that long, so you're not gonna see an immediate effect. You know what I mean? I think you might see one or two changes, but I think uh, the more successful they will be, the more successful they are, the more Killer Plank will buy into his style of fighting, and uh, that takes some time. You know what I'm saying? You're not gonna see a drastic 360 change in just a few eight, 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 eight and nine. We can't. So uh, I'm definitely expecting him to do his thing tonight, and uh, he's going to do good. And just the last thing for me, man. You know, fans love it when you break down a fight, man. Yeah. So I'm going to put you on the spot. <laughs> Don't be on the fence, man. Go ahead. Spence Crawford, who you leading Yo, You to know, him, I'm man. not being on the fence, man. Both of them are great fighters, bro. And they got to fight the fight in the ring. Spence got something about him that just like a, like a, like a, like a, uh, like a snow plower. And Crawford could do everything in the ring. I can't say, oh, he going to win or he going to win. They got to line up. Would they got to get in the ring and line up. Would you lean towards somebody? Though? No, because it's a great fight. They both two of the top, maybe two top. They definitely two best welterweights in the world. I don't know who going to win, bro. And I ain't just saying that. I don't play buddy ball. You know what I'm saying? I don't necessarily know Crawford, and I'm more cool with Arrow than I am with Crawford. You know what I'm saying? But it's a 50-50 it's a fight. I'm taking the emotions and feelings out of it. Them, them, they got to get in the ring and fight. Gotcha. Hey, right. Yesterday, I got a chance to, uh, just the whole week, um, everybody's been talking about Tank versus Ryan, Tank versus Ryan, Tank versus Ryan. Ryan's dad told me he thought it was imminent. I talked with Joe Goose and Joe Goose said, yeah, it feels like it might end up happening. Um, what are your thoughts if they did end up getting together? I haven't even thought about the fight, to be honest. I just think it's a, uh, it's a mega fight. It's just, it's, 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 in two short words, it's a mega fight. It's a, probably... It's like five mega fights in boxing right now that can be made. That's one of them. Is there, is there anybody in particular where you're just like, I think Ryan has the edge, I think Tank has the edge? Because the majority of people are picking Tank. I think Tank. Tank definitely got the edge. I think Ryan is, he, he, he a good fighter though, man. He a good fighter. He can show a lot of, he, he can show a lot of character in that, uh, was it Luke Campbell? Luke Campbell, yeah. Mm -hmm. And he got back up and he's just like, he showed a lot of character. 
he more than just, you know, good looks and, you know, and talk a lot of shit. He got some nuts to him, too. Gotcha. And actually, my last thing I wanted to ask you about, what do you think about a possible um, Shakur Stevenson versus um, Lomachenko fight, man? Let's say Loma is Loma, and, yeah. you know, Shakur already said he's moving I up. I don't think, I, man, every, like I said, every now and then, man, generations get, like, a few special fighters, man, and Shakur's one of them. He make everything look so easy. It looked like effortless with him, you know what I mean? Sometimes guys just blessed with certain gifts. And, and Lomachenko, one of them fighters, is blessed with gifts me a little bit older. You know what I'm saying? But uh, I like the fight. I like Thank Shakur in the fight, too. Thank you, bro. Yeah, Appreciate no you.